Hey guys, today I have uh, two reviews. I have Encore Snowman, Encore Snowman, not Encore, and uh, China Fake Snowman. Uh, these are two recent additions to my Rubber Snowman collection. I, I am doing this review like a uh, double review. I, I guess because I haven't made reviews on these and I got them, especially this one a while ago. And I just want to get them both out there, I guess. Let's start with the Encore one because it's the one I got most recently. So this is a small version of the Encore Snowman. Uh, they do have larger versions. Everest is a larger version. Uh, the one I... Everest. It's nobody that I have. There's the side. Does not say Encore Group on the back. They might have stu done that only on the Snow Buddies. Or in the year 2000. There's the side. Yes, a bell. Actually, something interesting. See, the rope or the string for the bell goes through his wrist and not through his hand. So that's kind of weird. In the front again. And uh, the sack, it's sewn on. Sewn onto there. And in the sack, there appears to be red berries. Some, uh, some ones like the red berries, but they're white and sparkly. There's, uh, the stuff they use to make, like, fake Christmas trees. Uh, some of those things. By toe. No. <laughs> A, a bow and a pine cone, that's what it looks to be. And uh, there's stuffing in the sack. And uh, the the buttons light up like that. And uh, also, the foam ball on the inside is not glued to uh, the the mechanism. I mean, the the foam ball is not glued to the head, so it just like kind of dances up and down instead of up and down and side to side like it should. But uh, yeah, here's the bottom. Uh, it takes four AA batteries on and off switch. It looks like the previous owners put like duct tape over the speaker of this, but that's not too surprising. This thing is pretty loud, and uh, it's fairly sensitive to sound. Also, it looks like they wrote something up there and then scribbled it out. And um, yeah, I think it's missing a, a berry on the top, stuffing in the hat. I think that's all I have to say about it, so I will show it now. I do have a video, um, where, uh, the it was still disassembled, and the rubber was, like, below or above, I can't remember if it was below or above the part where it attaches onto, and you could see it was actually dancing properly, it was going more like this than just like that, and, uh, it's pretty sensitive, uh, well, this one's more sensitive, but, uh, when it's on a hard surface, all you have to do is, like, I think you just, like, pretty much have to tap it. If you listen to the audio, there's actually like a pop uh, after, I think before too, um, there's like a little pop sound, um, and I'm not sure why it does that, but uh, I don't know if you can hear it. Up close Here and also it does this. Everest does that too. So yeah, I believe that's all I have to say about it. And also, um, if you hit the table, these jiggle. So yeah, that's that. Now onto the China fake one. Uh, there is actually a small, ver you know, they have the large and small version of these China fake ones. And uh, there is an, there is a small version of the one well, this one that looks exactly like this one because it's nine inches instead of twelve. And uh, yeah, 
put the old tape. So yeah, that's that. And actually, when I got it, the, the tie was loose, so I put, like, hot glue on it. So now it's tighter, like it should be. And, uh, sack has some nice designs on it. There's, like, stars, what looks to be the sun, there's clouds, and a bunch of dots. And other little designs. And uh, when I got it, this blue button did not light up. But I had to sacrifice a light from my fried one. Uh, so now it works. It's dimmer than the other ones for some reason, but uh, at least it does work. And uh, there's stuffing in the hat. The hat is. There's actually stuffing in the brim too. Um, yeah, bell rings. They act actually goes through his hand. And uh, in the bag, there's there's a trumpet, red berries, a branch, and a little present. And, uh, there's, there's, like, red around this red button. And on my fried one, there's not as much, like, color around the buttons like, like that. But there is around the candle. So I don't know why, it, why it's like that. But, um, it is. And also, this one looks up more. I'm convinced that these are different ears. Because, um, like, there's, like, legs down here. Then there's a disc up here in the mechanism. But the disc is two parts bottom part is like dark green but on this one it's like a light translucent blue and on the other one it's this it's either black or the same color as the bottom which is kind of strange and uh, this is with the bottom that piece cracked off i have it i have the piece in my pocket but i think it's still in there it's in my closet and uh so it takes three double a batteries and actually has the qc pass of one just kind of ironic, it has a lower pass than my other one, and this is the only one that works. But, uh, like, yeah. And that one actually has a cube key passive too. It's down there. Um, and, uh, but this one, not only did this light not work, but actually, uh, it was snapped. I don't, I'm not sure if it happened during shipping. It didn't say anything about it being snapped during, no, in the listing. But, uh, I was able to glue it back on. And actually, I didn't glue one of the legs back on, and the ones that are glued only have, like, a dot of hot glue, so, um, it might come off easily, but, uh, I'll just enjoy it while I can. And, uh, I don't think I put the rubber back on evenly, because if you look at it, I'm not sure if you can tell from here, but, uh, it's, like, not very even. Here, squeaking, too. So, um, this one's a little more sensitive than the Encore no man. uh, I don't think I have anything else to say about it, so I will turn it on now. foam ball in this one, because they both have foam balls in the mechanism, in the same mechanism too, except this this one there's like a thing that comes out of the side to make it hit. there's a thing that comes out of the side to make it like tilt and this one there's a knob that spins and goes into two notches that makes it tilt side to side, so yeah that's like that and um I think I was gonna, oh yeah uh, the screw holder for the the screw that holds um, the circuit board in place. Actually, um, on the other one, my fried one, the screw holder is broken, so the screw came out. It made it easy to get the rubber off. And uh, it's actually the same for this one. So, yeah, it's easy to fix. I don't, I, I don't know if they're all like that. They might be. I think, I think they are because uh, it's the same case for both of my of these. I have to get a small one too. Uh, because, you know, I only have the large ones. The large ones are harder to find, but uh, I'd also like to get a small version. Uh, I don't think I have anything else to say about it, so I'll show it again.
this one's even more sensitive. I think you have to tap the table lightly, lighter to get it to go. Okay, uh, I'll show them at the same time. Thanks for watching.